Hello guys, that's here back again with another video. So today I have uh, something very interesting for you. So today we're gonna install a ROM. So uh, the ROM is very, very interesting. So I haven't uh, taken a look at it uh, yet. So this is uh, going to be some kind of a new video. So today we're going to install it. So uh, we should first boot into recovery. So let me just use my both hands to do that. You know the volume up button, the power button and the home button all at the same time. So the only thing I have uh, done is just to put the ROM into the phone memory. So uh, right now we're going to wipe and the uh, factory reset the phone. So after it is uh, done, you just go back twice, then go to install. Probably this is some very well known process to you, so if you want you can uh, always skip that part. Let me just find the system. So yeah, over here on the Edge Lit S8 port version uh, 2.0. So uh, this is uh, a new ROM which was uh, released very, very... Uh, probably today, I think it was uh, released today. So this is going to be my uh, first look at it. Here is uh, the change walk. You can uh, always click the pause button and uh, take a look at it. As you can see it is a formatting and extracting system. So this will uh, make a full wipe of the phone so that uh, be sure to first backup all of your data so that you don't lose anything. So after the install is finished I will be back, so I'll just pause the video right now. So uh, here we are again, I think it will be ready in just a couple of seconds. Because it uh, has already passed that 60% uh, uh, part, so it is just now rooting the phone. So it comes with pre-installed root, as you can see over here, super user, and also Magisk version uh, 12 that all. So it's the latest one, so after it's installed, just click next and uh, if you want uh, you can uh, finish. So yeah, I will finish it and also reboot the device. After the install is done and the ROM is booted, I will also go and install the dual speaker mode. So also there are two zips that come uh, in the forum, you will see that there is also a zip for disabling the soft key navigation button, so you can see that if you don't want to if you want to use those buttons over here and not the on-screen one, there is a zip, you only flash it and they will be disabled. So the first boot, as you know, will take a, a couple of seconds or minutes probably. So again, I'll be sure to be back as soon as the phone boots. So after your device boots, it's just going to happen right now. Yeah, you can see that uh, there is a new wallpaper, so let me just enter my pin. So after the first boot, uh, you know, as uh, every other ROM, you just uh, choose your language and uh, all of those stuff. So I'll be sure to be back as soon as uh, I enter my information. So uh, here we are again, right after uh, I press the last button onto the setup screen. So as you can see, this is uh, the navigation bar, which looks very interesting. So uh, these are the apps that come uh, pre-installed uh, with the ROM. So uh, you can always take a look at, the, at them. First, let me sort them alphabetically. So these are the others, which are in the folder. So uh, the nav keys are working uh, very good. You can see that there is also a uh, Bixby and everything that is, uh, for example, the S8 launcher too. So uh, let's go under settings. You can see that this is the stock settings app. So I will make a full review of the ROM and uh, also a battery life update as soon as uh, I spent some time uh, with the ROM. So something I saw which was very interesting just right now is that the calendar shows uh, the date that it is now because before it was uh, showing always uh, 27th or 28th, I'm not sure. So now it will 
always show you the the right time and also I think that the quok app is uh, also showing the quok just like it is on here on the icon so for example right now it is uh, 520 but I will see as time passes if it will move or not so uh, also as I told you I'm uh, going to make uh, a review of the ROM later day or probably tomorrow I'll make it tomorrow so that I have uh, spent time with the ROM oh that's very nice uh, animation so right now I'm uh, going to go into recovery just to show you how to disable your software buttons and install the dual speaker mode because uh, I don't uh, really like the software buttons so I just had to get into recovery so external XD first uh, I will install the dual speaker mode version 19 and also the disable navbar so uh, that is it, it is as simple as that, so now we will just wait for the device to boot up. So the whole process of installing the ROM took me about uh, 4 to 5 minutes. So and also setting up the device took me also uh, 5 minutes I think. So the whole process will take you about 10 minutes and to restore the backup another 10 minutes. So your device will be probably in this setup process for about 20 minutes. You can see that uh, it booted. it. Uh, very very nicely so I will make a stability test over here and uh, will tell you whether the ROM is uh, worth it but uh, I think it will worth it I think that the developer have done a great job but we will see and also we'll see how the battery wife is uh, doing so uh, be sure to click that uh, like button to help me out and also subscribe to see the other videos that are uh, coming about this ROM so the full review is coming in a couple of days so uh, thank you for watching guys you're awesome bye